Hallelujah. It's all right. It's all right to give him the praise. It's all right. I bless the name of the Lord in this house on today. God is awesome in this place. He is awesome. I give him all the praise, all the glory, all the honor. Wonderful Jesus. He loves us on today. Hallelujah. Thank you for new grace and new mercy. Hallelujah. Not going to be before you very long. I'm just going to give you what the Lord gave me. And if I can use for a topic, it's called, the topic would be, a praise is required. Right. Yeah. Look at your neighbor say, neighbor, a praise is required from you. A praise is required from you. Hallelujah. Just want to encourage you on today to keep a praise in your mouth. Even if it's a sacrifice of praise, keep a praise. Hallelujah. Keep it because it's required. Especially for the believer of God. See, the reason why your praise is required is because your praise confuses the enemy. Hallelujah. Did you hear what I said? Your praise confuses the enemy. If you want to make some demons and some devils tremble, go to praising God like you don't lost your mind. If you want to see him trigger, go to praising God. Yes. Lift up the name of Jesus. Yes. Magnify his name and give him the glory. Yes. That problem that you thought you had. Yes. Look at your neighbor and say, neighbor, the problem that you thought you had. Yes. It won't be a problem anymore after you go to praising God. Yes. Instead, it'll be a triumph. to the Lord. Yes. Anybody want to set up a sweet smell and say Pray the mic you don't lost your mind. Hallelujah. In a set up a sweet, pleasant fragrance to his nostrils. Yes. It makes God happy yes. when you praise him. Yes. When you pray, when the pray, when the creator seizes his creation, praising him, it makes him happy. Yes. It's giving him back his glory. Anybody want to give him back yes. his glory? And he sees you not only pray to him for what he does for you, but for who he is to you. Hallelujah. See, a lot of pray, people pray to God for stuff. But I don't pray to him for the stuff, minister. I pray to him because who he is to me. He is God Almighty right by himself. Hallelujah. He is the creator. Hallelujah. He sees your faith increasing when you praise him. In spite of every circumstance, or situation he blesses you according to your faith in him yes. how many know it, as stated in Proverbs 10 and 22 the blessings of God is make it make it rich yes. and add no sorrow yes. Hallelujah. so that lets me know every good and perfect thing comes from above yes. so if you sit up a pray a good blessing is going to come down but you first got to sit up a pray required because it breaks down every hindrance, every stronghold, every plot, every plan that the enemy can send your way. Anybody need some stronghold broken in this house on the day? Well, you gotta sit up a praise. Hallelujah. You gotta sit up a praise. Hallelujah. When you sit up a praise, it will cancel the enemy's assignment. See, the weapons may form, but guess what? They ain't gonna prosper. Because you don't send up a praise. Hallelujah. You don't send up a praise. They may prosper, but they will never work. 
that you have set up before him. Hallelujah. When you didn't feel like giving him the praise, you gave it to him anyhow. Hallelujah. When you didn't have no money in your pocket, you still prayed for Hallelujah. When your body seemed as if it wasn't feeling the best, you still gave God praise. Hallelujah. God will remember when you praise him. Hallelujah. Even when folks talked about you and criticized, and you knew they were talking about you.
knows about his children. Yes. God responds to our praises. Yes. And he will not allow your praise to be wasted. So if you send it up, it ain't in vain. Yes. He sees it and he's going to respond to your praise. Yes. Hallelujah. If you praise God for whatever you need him to do and exercise your faith and work towards it, then God got to do it. He got to do it for you. Hallelujah. Your praise has locked a contract with him. It's like a covenant that you have made with God when you sit up a praise. Hallelujah. It's a covenant with God. Your praise is required because it says to God, even in what I'm going through, it doesn't matter because I know you're going to bring me out. And be stronger. Yes, and it's called for me to work harder. harder. So therefore, that in itself is still a reason to give God a praise. Yeah. Hallelujah. As I go to my seat, remember, saints, as a believer, your praise is required. When you walk through those doors, your praise is required. 